South Africa's last apartheid president, F.W. de Klerk, has withdrawn from speaking at an American Bar Association seminar on minority rights, racism and the rule of law, amid a barrage of criticism over his involvement. The Bar Association is a major player in the American legal system, and de Klerk was scheduled to speak on July the 1st at a virtual event. But on Sunday, de Klerk's foundation said the head of South Africa's white minority government until 1994 did not want to embarrass himself or his hosts in the currently charged racial climate. <laughs> South African opposition parties and activists had called on ABA to cancel de Klerk's attendance, given his role in the apartheid-era security apparatus. Though the foundation said the allegation that de Klerk was involved in gross violations of human rights was baseless. 30 years after the end of apartheid, de Klerk's role remains highly contested in South Africa, one of the world's most unequal societies where class and race issues constantly bubble under the surface. The F.W. de Klerk Foundation defended his legacy of aiding South Africa's transition from white minority rule, for which he shared a Nobel Peace Prize with Nelson Mandela, and for being the only world leader to dismantle an existing nuclear arsenal. But earlier this year, de Klerk faced another backlash after he told a national broadcaster that he did not believe apartheid was a crime against humanity.